Alright. What's up, YouTube? Today, I am going to be showing you how to make your film look professional. So, alright, what we want to do is right click in this project box and new comp. Go to HD TV 720 by and 29.97 frames per second. Click on that and then click OK. Now get your film and drag it down here to comp. Your film is not going to fill up this entire space, so you want to resize it. So there's no black showing. So that just looks really, really boring to me. So what I'm going to do is we're going to go over here to the effects and presets and type in color balance. Alright, so now that we have that, just drag it over onto your film. And I already have a preset called film look. And I will put this in the description of what this is. And your shadow blue balance needs to be 30. Your mid-tone green balance needs to be 15. Your highlight blue balance needs to be negative 50. And you want to preserve luminosity or else it will look like this. Really boring. Alright, so it looks old-timey like, but I really like this. It looks really good. So we also want to go over here and type in shadow forward slash and you should get shadow slash highlight and drag that onto your film and it makes the saturation really good saturates it just enough but I don't like it that dark so we're gonna go to blend with original and type in 60 so it gives it just enough saturation to look pretty pretty good but that's not all now we're gonna go up here to this and it's called the ellipse tool just click hold it and select a ellipse or you can tap Q so now that you have that you can just double click that and it will draw an ellipse circle perfectly on your video now go down here to mask one feather mask feather and drag this up to 200 or 250 I like 250 so you can just type that in and click on mask and click on the video my bad click on the video and this button right here turns your mask on and off the yellow lines so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna double click on these and drag this one down because I don't want my whole video to be dark drag these up drag these over so just your corners are dark now that looks pretty good to me let's scroll through it that looks really good the whites are going to be really bright in this, so try to avoid that color because it'll throw your entire video off unless you want a lot of contrast. So, that is basically it for this tutorial. I'll be making more. Check out my Sony Vegas tutorial on this exact same thing on how to do that. It'll be pretty good. So, rate, comment, and subscribe. Thanks for watching.